I think I might need a microphone in order to do my job here. Can't have it sitting off in the middle of nowhere, just kind of doing its own thing. So tonight, week one of the Alberta War Table series for April. What this format is, is, is a tiered event. Um, I think it's three matches and then the finals at the very end. I'm going to be playing. Thank you very much, Brian, for for liking the stream. Um, it, it He's actually the organizer of all of this. So he's the one that sets up the matches. He's actually playing in it as well. So there's no favoritism to him at all. I would never, never assume that the organizer would give himself beneficial matches. I also love um, talking crap about Brian as much as possible because we have such a great relationship as, as friends and as opponents. Um, so with that said, uh, it is a two list brawl machine format. Um, it is a uh, 75 minute clock. And with that, um, there is no specialist. Yeah, Brian's uh, actually uh, is playing high shields. What's uh, what, what are the two casters you're playing, Brian? You have Malakov in Hearts of Darkness and who's the other one? Guest on two. Oh, thank you very much. Uh, Mike, who is my opponent for the night, for liking the stream. Also, if you haven't seen, uh, if you don't know who Mike is, Michael Blarg, he's also known as Fatal Swordsman. You should check him out at uh, www.twitch.tv slash Fatal Swordsman. He will, he might be uh, running this as well as on his stream. So I don't, I'm not 100% sure. However, if you like me, you can, and you can watch me. If you like him, go watch him. Either way, you'll get a different little bit of, uh, you'll get a different feel uh, of content to, in between. Um, so with that said, I'm going to invite him into chat. I'm sure he hears me right now. Where is he? There he is. Not a friend. Has to be. Just send a friend request. I'm going to invite him to a call. Hello. Hi. Hi. Let's see if you're if uh, you're registering. Let's say some stuff. Uh, Perfect. I can see oh. green. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm going to adjust your volume just slightly as I do everyone. And by adjust, I mean crank everyone to 200. <laughs> so, I've already explained the the uh, um, the game that we're playing. Uh, I've explained that we are. It's the War Table series. Um, would you like to add anything? I also plugged your uh, your uh, Twitch channel. Yes, I saw that. Thank you. You're welcome. I mean, I have to pay it forward super hard because Brian <laughs> literally helped me double my subscribers uh, in uh, in about a month. Like, and all it took is a little bit of pain from him being inflicted on him by his children. Uh, also, ah. yeah. Also, uh, if you guys haven't subscribed to my uh, YouTube channel or my Twitch channel or uh, followed me on Facebook, it is www.facebook.com slash the community killer, twitch.tv slash the community killer and youtube.com slash the community killer. Uh, other than that, I think uh, I think we're pretty much good to go. Did you uh, want to talk talk to the matchups or just pick them? Ah, we can just pick them. Alrighty. Go to my video game stream. There we go. I got mine picked. Ooh, old Ooh. witch. Were you were you expecting uh, old witch? No, I was expecting Karchev. Oh really? I was actually I was kind of expecting uh, Saren. I mean, I Karchev doesn't want to see anime <laughs> really at all. Yeah, that's kind of what I was hoping. I mean, Old Witch is just is just pure fun. All right, let's go through terrain real quick. So we have a wall. 
And we have a burning earth, so cloud, fi continuous fire, um, and cover. We have a trench. We have another burning earth. We have another wall down here. I believe that's part of the train. Yes, it is. We have another trench. We have an obstruction, and we have another trench. And a big old forest in the middle. Mm -hmm. Seems good. Would you like to dice off for first turn, sir? Sure. I got a one. Ooh. I got a six. I will take first turn. I'm going to take bottom. Probably not a bad plan. I kind of wish I went Saren. Why? I think she's better into Old Witch. You think so? Yeah. What makes you say that? Uh, just the guns let me deal with the swordsmen without having to get close to them. Yeah, a little bit. I mean, that Angelius is super neat too. The Angelius is going to go real far. <laughs> 14 inches is it by math, right? Speed 7 against Construct goes to 9, charges to 12, 14, yeah? Yeah. That's real good. It's going to hurt real bad. By the way, I've never played Old Witch, so uh, it'd be really, uh, really interesting. I don't even know what she does either. Oh. Oh, yeah, right. She's the feet that's like Harby. It's it's Harby plus. Well, now it now it's Harby plus. It used to be smaller Harby. Well, correct. It's uh, it also knocks down warrior models mm. when you get damaged by it. All right, you're gonna go here. You know, here. And... I think... Uh, is that where I want everything to go? I think that's where I want everything to go. Yep. Yeah. Alright, over to you. Okay. I don't know what I'm doing. Let's be serious here. I've never played this caster. I've never played Animeg, so we're both... You're kidding me, right? I do not own Animeg, and I've never played Animeg. Is this like a Virus 2 flex? Is this like... I, I, <laughs> I don't own Virus 2, so I've never played Virus 2? Yeah. Jeez, Mike. Honestly, I probably have have more experience playing against Animag than most Animag players have played her. We should just swap lists. I could play Animag. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll go with that for deployment. That's everything? You deployed? Yeah. Okay. Uh, Brian's saying the random casters people have taken in this event is awesome. Like really, there's some some people that got some like really good casters. Like Animax an amazing caster. However, um <laughs> some people got got some poop. Some people got some real poop. Mm -hmm. uh, like I rolled out um uh the casters for McCorkel and I felt kind of bad because the first two casters I rolled up from were Fiona and Gordon, which are both bad, not banned. <laughs> they're quote unquote, <laughs> sorry, they're on the epic list. So they're both banned. Um, so it's hilarious. But then I ended up giving them uh, rolling up or not rolling. I did the, the whole like randomized wheel thing. Um, and he got Durgan and uh, and Rahara. 
I don't know if her hair is good in in Brawl Machine. And I feel like she would be. Not bad, but actually, yeah, she might be. But Durgan, she can try and super solo a bit. Durgan's not bad. Like Durgan with Case Cracker isn't a bad thing. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I am finished deploying. You have no AD. No idea. Okay, so I will hit that done button, and I will start this clock. You good to go? Yep. Alrighty, starting clock. I am going to allocate. Oops. Because I have so many jacks. One to you. The yeah, Saren in this matchup, I think, could be really good because she just knifes all your Doom Reavers to death. With Far Strike? Yeah, potentially. Okay. Far Strike, Grievous Wounds, Knives seem, seem good. I mean, you're still Thread 11. Yeah. I mean, you don't want. You don't want her caught out in the middle of nowhere. No, she does not have the armor to survive. Okay, operations are done. Actually, let's go like that real quick. I am going to start up with. What do I start up with first? Uh, I think. I think the Doom River start up first. They don't have vengeance, do they? They do not have vengeance. Okay, right. just apparition. Yeah. Because you can shoot them with the Naga Night Lurker, right? And the Angelius. Oh yeah, Angelius has a gun too. Yes, the gun. Everyone forgets that that thing has. Yeah, it's. I mean, it's a hand cannon, right? Yeah, it's range twelve, path twelve. Where are those guys? There they are. Animag's personal threat is what? 11? Uh, speed 5, 2 inch range, so it's 10 base, 12 against constructs. 10 base, 12 against constructs. I could probably stay back a little bit. I don't need to be that far forward, I don't think. And she has Gallows and Hex Blast for spells I can't target you with. Yeah. <laughs> There's a lot of my list that you can't really target. It's like, as I was saying this sentence, I was like, wait, they're immune to spells. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's not a bad little spot. Do you have any way of giving them Pathfinder? I do. Um, they can get Relentless Charge uh, through um, the Greylord Escort. And I can give her give them wheel, uh, Weld Secrets. Okay. Yeah. Those are Warmongers, not War Spears, right? Those are Warmongers. The idea was I can answer a uh, heavy defense skew with them. Yeah. Because they get up to the most ridiculous mat imaginable. I kind of need these guys to not be... I'm just going to use my widget. Use my three-inch ring. Because it saves me on clock, I think. Yeah, they really do get to the to the most ridiculous pow out there. You would have to be somewhere like there. It's oh, not Matt. A, what's that? They get to the most ridiculous Matt. Yeah. Maybe I just go to stay on the other side. Uh, you know what? I mean, I guess they get to POW 18 too. Yeah, that's that's the <laughs> clincher right there. And they have vengeance. Yep. And they threaten inch farther than your Doom Reavers before apparition. Yeah, it's apparition that gives me that that clinch. Yeah, you get one inch advantage. I 
But Vengeance gives me a two inch advantage if you trigger it. Yeah, I mean, I'm an idiot. I might give you it. <laughs> Yeah, that unit getting to mat 12, pow 18 is kind of silly. It really is really good for a defense skew. What's a command on, on the uh, leader on these things? The Doom Reaver? Yeah. Uh, UA is command Wait. 9. Oh, okay. According to the university page. Your mat five, or rat five um, on that thing. The naga is six. The angelius is five. Okay. Maybe I just stay back. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I mean, if you really want to come in on me. Let me get that guy in there properly. Okay. Ruin. Run. POW 12 Weapon Masters. Yep. Uh, Greylord. Uh, no, you need to move. Oh, yeah, you do. I'm going to move up here. And you are going to give old witch a cloud which i will tack on to her when she's done her done her everything uh did they change it or can you not target them with willed secrets what's that the doom reavers uh no they can't be targeted by spells you're right okay yeah. <laughs> i was like i was pretty sure they couldn't be targeted by anyone okay scrapjack I mean, you still have Pathfinder through Relentless, yeah. so that's fine. Yeah. Uh, Void Archon. Where do you want to fly off to? This is a really interesting side for me to kind of bully off of. So. Mm. Uh, Old Witch. I need you to always have your control zone. <laughs> hey, Chris, thanks for uh, for liking. Okay, so let's look at my spells real quick. Yeah, it's going to be an annoying feat to deal with. And add a widget. And that it's pretty good there. I know I don't do a whole lot. Then we're going to add a widget, branch ring, and that. That was three. Do I put up avatar slaughter? Why not? Uh, I'm going to put up avatar onto scrapjack.
Well, that looks like a fun spell. Right? And then... He's gonna go. He's gonna run to there. Hmm, or do I go to the other side? Yeah, you can go over there. And then Butcher. And that'll be over to you. Okay. Those Doom Reavers really get up there. Yeah, I forgot that you couldn't cast any spells on those things. I thought it was just like um, Sacred Ward. Nah. Yeah, Brian, it'll be uh, <laughs> it's it's Kador month for me. Okay. Yeah, weld secrets. It's uh, it's how we put together pipelines in Alberta. So I won't be able to see him. You're hiding your Doom Reavers from me. I am. Warmonger's going to run like so. Mm -hmm. What's this? Three inch ring? Oh, I was just using that for line of sight. Okay. Yeah. Angelius is going to run to here. Chosen are going to run. Mm -hmm. I'm just curious if there's a way I can see. I can see the right hand or the left hand guy, I think. Yeah, I should be able to easily see him with the Naga. Yeah, I think there's an angle there. I think that was pretty much the only angle that was sitting there. Yeah, it's like I might be able to see two in some world, but I'm not going to shoot a two. I'm going to shoot number five. Okay. Because uh, his is a lot easier, and I don't think it matters that much. Yeah. I mean, you ignore concealment, right? Yes. Okay. Def 13. Your speed uh, five or six? Hit. Speed six. Okay. Boosting to hit. We're at six. That'll hit. Yep. Uh, oh. That'll also crit shadow bind in case you tough. It's POW 12. 
I do not tough. Okay. Animag's going to be real sad and scared. <laughs> She's going to walk to here. Cast Bond of Gristle and Bone on the Chosen. Mm hmm for two. And I think that's all she's going to do. And then the Mechanic Strider is going to run to here. Oh, I'll drop one. That's what I need to do. Mm -hmm. uh, that'll be go. Okay. All right, I upkeep both my upkeeps are free. I will operate. You threat twelve on the chosen. Uh, did you mean to keep Animeg at a point one movement? No. Okay. Can you threat 10 inches with the uh, Warmongers? Warmongers base threat is 10, 12 with many feet. 12 with many feet? I think you just get no relentless quarter. charge. Nope, it's no quarter. They get Pathfinder, straight up Pathfinder, and okay. plus two movement speed. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's no quarter. Okay. Are you running away from me? I'm just trying to figure out what my options are right now. <laughs> so, Aldrich is going to go there for sure. What are the... You only bring back Doom Reavers when they kill stuff, right? Uh, It's only the escort that can bring stuff back. No, I don't even think it's it's that. I swear there was a way to bring them back. There is a way. I don't know if there's... I thought there was. I think it's... Oh, I think it's the Turnians that do that. You kill something, and then you get stuff. Okay, so yeah. it's a solo. Yeah. Okay, so... I, know, I just know I've seen Doom Reavers come back. Oh, yeah. Like, it's a thing. So that's an option. I could just back up. Ah, yes. They have a spell that's range 10, pow 12. If you box, you RFP and return to Doom Reaver. Yeah, that's it. Okay. I know you have to come in on me next turn. I know you're going to be going after Ruin. Kind of a thing, and you're going to be feeding. I go there. I'm like there. I'm pretty safe there. Okay, let's put some let's actually allocate properly you get one you already have one because i'm bad you're going up to seven okay i think i have my game plan
that uh, plus two to movement. It's just for charging. Just for charging, just against constructs. Just for charging, just against constructs. It also gives them Pathfinder. Okay. Oh, no, I'm talking about the Blighted, but the Ogren. Oh, the Ogren, it's plus two inches of movement. Is it Bloodthirst or is it just plus it's two no movement? Quarter. Okay, I don't, I, I, I don't know that one. It's on a lot of pirate units. <laughs> you assume that I know anything about pirates. Yeah. It's, other than it's when just, Brian this... jams me with them. Yeah, it's this activation models the unit gain Pathfinder, a model that charges as part of its normal movement gets plus two inches of movement. So it is charges. Okay. All right, he's going to run to there. I never actually operated with these guys, but I don't think I'm going to. The uh, Chosen have Pathfinder too, right? Yes, they have Pathfinder. Just because they're... Yeah. So they have a 9-inch walking... They have walking a 9-inch walking thread. Cancel that one. How far are you out? Yeah, that's good. Sure, come on in. Maybe I don't want more than one. Actually, you need to still have line of sight to me, so. to just get out of the way. Okay. Butcher. What's a pal on the uh, on the Ogren War Spears? The Warmongers is War Monger, base yeah. fourteen. Fourteen? Yes. Really like to uh, go and shoot that one guy. Really not going to give you vengeance. <laughs> <laughs> I really am not going to. Oh, I see where you put those guys now. Right in murder range. I totally don't threat the flag. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I don't have to threat the flag because you don't have... <laughs> unless you want to put your caster... I have no there. solos. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm like, Hurter, where do I put all my solos? I have so many of them. What do I do? Yes, yeah, Saren, I think, would have been the better choice. You think so? But I expected you to go Karchev. Oh, really? Yeah. I don't, I don't think I could have dropped Karchev just because of the, the, the crazy stuff that you can do. I don't know. Saren into Karchev would have been hard for me, I think. I 
I think Saren Dekarchev would have been would have been disastrous for you, actually. Yeah. It would have come down to if I could assassinate Karchev. Pretty much. Which with poison bows might actually happen, but you never know. True. Okay. Old Witch. No, I expected Animag and Karchev, and then I was expecting you to tell me to play Saren, because I said I'd try and play Saren at least once this tournament. Yeah, I didn't... And my I, response would be, I'd play Saren if you play Old Witch. Pretty much. Well... But instead, we get this matchup. Yeah, I, we, we did get Old Witch. Okay, uh... Oh. You're moving too far. Uh, old witch could probably go right about there. Is that where I want to go? I think that's where I want to go. You're going to shoot at me anyways. I don't think you're really going to shoot at me. But you go there. Uh, I'm going to feet. Mm-hmm. And do I have anything else I really need to cast? I don't think I do. You're going to shoot one of my dudes with your dude. Can't really charge me too much. Grailer's going to go here. Oh, Grailer's not going to go there. Grailer's going to go here. And he's going to put a cloud onto Old Witch. Yes, and, all the cloud. <laughs> right? I need all the clouds. And Butcher, you still need to do something. I don't know what you need to do, though. I really don't. Okay. Oh, I already moved him, didn't I? He was 12.1 away. Okay. He's going to sit tight there. And I'm going to clock over to you. Okay. I had Chris message me because I forgot to clock over to you at the end of my turn. <laughs> oh, did you? Mm-hmm. It's a good thing I, I, I really don't think it's going to come down to the clock. I don't think so either. I think it's going to be a... Someone's going to blow somebody else up. Well, the thing is, I don't think I can do anything to you this turn because you kept, like, everything away. I guess you should do Fury. Uh, one, two, three. Oh, we are both purple. <laughs> One duck. <laughs> I just noticed that. I forgot to take my focus off. Hmm. So I have to contest something. Mm hmm. Yes, you do. And I can't score my flag because if I go to my flag, I die. <laughs> What are you talking about? I can't score your flag because I have no souls. I dislike your feet so very, very much. Just put everything inside of it. No. Why not? I don't like my stuff knocked down. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah. Chosen are going to walk like so, so that one guy's walking into your feet. Okay, clock to me. You're currently armor 19, correct? Correct. Uh, no Doesn't damage. Doesn't take damage. Nope. So he's not knocked down. Nope. I'm okay with this. Uh, the Naga's going to go. It's going to walk to here and take a shot at number okay, one. Clock to me. Uh, it's not a warrior model. It doesn't take your feet. It still takes damage. It doesn't take the knockdown. I'll pause. Just to confirm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Warrior model's damaged. Okay. Okay. So, going to restart. Okay. So Armor 15. Uh, 11 to the 5. Ow. Of course that knocks out spirit. <laughs> wow. Uh, still shooting at number one. Okay. Uh, def 13. That'll hit. Yep. Pow 12. Uh, oops. Stop check. Nope. Okay. What's Butcher Zero's threat range? Uh, butcher four, it is yeah, ten. Four. Unless you start making me walk places. Okay. I also have gallows. Right, gallows, and you have an arc node and scrapjack. Yeah. The jealous is just gonna wiggle up a little bit and boost a shot at number four. He is only rat five. But that'll hit. Yep. Pal? Twelve. Oops. Okay, he is on fire because I crit. Okay. Warmongers. Warmongers are gonna walk this guy is going to run or well, they're going to run charge okay this guy's going to run to here i think it's well one one at a time because i have to I he's have the to... only one going to go in okay i'm just going to double check where everybody else is going to go but i'm fairly certain i only want him going in Their armor 15, right? Uh, 16 base. 16? Okay. Yeah, they'll go like that. So just the one guy. Okay. Uh, dies. Dies? Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, I wasn't sure if I wasn't transmitting and be like, no, disconnect issues. I was just making sure the knockdown was after the damage. Or it's, was when damaged and when not damaged. after its result. Yeah. Okay. Animag's gonna walk up to here. You don't want to walk into my feet? Come no. on. Come on. And I'm gonna spend two to heal the Naga. Now we'll spend four. And the Mechanical Shredder is going to rile and run to here. Okay. And that is go. Okay. So, nobody scores anything. Mm -hmm. Ooh, 
that have been really fun if I would have killed that guy. Uh, apparates. Which guy? Oh, uh, I need to roll on fire. Uh, it's still up. And he's probably dead. Okay. Apparate. We can turn off her aura now, right? Yeah. Just because the red with melee ranges kind of messes with me. Yeah. Within three inches. Okay. Three inches. Oh, I could have backed up. No, I couldn't have, because I wouldn't have been able to see him. Cancel you, cancel you. Okay. You go over here. Uh, is number three supposed to be outside of three inches? No, they're supposed to be within three. Oh, I see. And then you go there. There. Uh, I'm going to drop crows. No, I don't think I need to allocate anything. Focus to you. Focus to you. Oh, there's one more Doom Reaver. Why are you... Oops. I don't know if I can see him. The Chosen? Oh, yeah. Oh, well, maybe not. What do you think? I believe the forest extends farther than that. Okay. Okay. If we're going by the white outline or the... It would, if we're going it by the green outline, close. it's not. Yeah. If we're going by the white outline, it does. Yeah, it was super close. Okay. So... Scrapjack needs to go. I can still pull you, right? Yeah. Okay. What would what would stop pulling me? Uh just making sure I get an angle on the wall. Yes, you need to not give me. I mean, you have a lot of leeway. Yeah, I just need to make sure that I can get you closer. Actually, it's a 10-inch range, right? I think so. Yeah, it's basically that's the line. Okay. I just don't know how far I can drag you. That's the big issue for mm -hmm. me. You can always roll a 1. It's true. I mean, even a one isn't terrible. <laughs> I don't want to screw my charge lane either. He can go there. Yes, yes, I will be set on fire. <laughs> burn, burn, burn in the glorious ring of fire. Okay. The Grey Lord Escort and the Doom Ravers are going to do a run charge. Mm -hmm. The Escort is going to do the Entropic Aura. Uh, and these guys will be charging half speed. Entropic Aura is, I believe it's, it's not Entropic Aura, it's Spell Curse. It's Entropic Aura in everything but name. 
Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Your defense 12, right? Chosen Overblight are defense 12. All right. And they are mat five, so I'm hitting on fives. That's a five. Uh, and it, they are going to be POW 12, your armor 19, 19. off 7. Cool, Take one. one. Uh, second one. Super hits, off 7. POW! <laughs> right in the kisser! That'll do it. All right. that can leave all right and I'm just gonna move him right about here okay old witch is gonna go mm -hmm. old witch is gonna boost your defense 14 right yes okay I'm gonna boost a uh, uh, gallows into the angelius Mm -hmm. uh, I will need a seven. Good boost. Uh, I will drag you five inches. Good with that drag? Mm -hmm. And then what's your armor? Armor 17. 17? Uh, I believe it's power 13 on this, right? Uh, I believe so. Mm -hmm. I'm still learning my rules. Uh, I don't think I I want I don't think I need to boost this. Uh, yeah, why not? I hit. I might as well boost it. Uh, there's nothing shenanigany about me boosting damage on this guy, right? Nope. Okay, arm seventeen off four. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. Two damage to the six. Oops. Uh, Orsus is going to go. He's going to charge. Uh, actually, no, he's not going to charge yet. Do proper order of operations. Speed six. Oh, I'm going to set Orsus on fire for sure. He's going to go here. Uh, he is going to make his charge attack. I'm going to boost the charge attack. I hit. Good boost. Mm -hmm. uh, you are dice armor. Uh, straight dice. Nope. Yeah. Dice off two. 13 go to 15. Yeah. 12 to the one. Uh, second initial. Boost and a hit. It's boosting damage. Uh, 12. Oh, dead. Uh, do I... Do I just get him out of there, though? <laughs> I've never been in this situation. <laughs> Yeah, that was not worth killing a Doom Reaver over. Yep. 
Okay, he's going to go here. Don't think I need to be that close, though. Nope. Need to actually do a legal movement. No, we'll just go like here. There's no here. He's gonna spray. Chris is covering us. He's telling us to switch clock and stuff like that. Apparently, it, we've been chewing through your clock potentially. You're good now. Huh? Yeah, for some reason, I think you said switch clock. Clock? Is this an old witch? Yes, this is an old witch that's list. Old. Yeah, it is old. Okay. Yeah, the clock was 25 minutes ago. Yeah. Uh, what's your defense? On the Mechano Shredder? 12. 12? Need a 6. That'll work. Uh, on the back of the Chosen number 1? would be a 10, so I need a 4. That'll work. And then front on number 2? Will not hit. Uh, armor on the Shredder? 15. 15? Dice plus 1. Sure. That's one. Oh, almost one shot it. To the? Uh, to the four. On uh, number one. Uh, your arm. 19. 19? Yeah. Off five. Nothing. Uh, okay, Butcher. What are you going to do? Which are bullies? Butcher goes here and waits for you to come to me. I don't know what to do with my hands. <laughs> what do you do? What do I do? I've never done this before. Yes, this is an old witch list. Yeah, that was a bit disgusting killing the angel. That was just that was really gross. That should not have happened. I mean, you did give me full souls, but when I'm rolling 14s, it'd be like, what? Yeah, you rolled what two you 14s on it? the damage rolls. Yeah, and the other two damage came from a boosted gallo, so it's like. One of those okay i guess uh -huh. i guess i could just be an absolute like i guess dick i guess about this it. happens now yeah like thanks for being an a-hole ian this is why we can't have nice things <laughs> uh, i'm gonna go here uh no i'm not gonna go there i'm gonna write about here and Put a cloud oops, onto Old Witch because just keeping people honest, right? And pin that down. I, I mean, does the cloud really do anything? It, None I, of my guns care. She, I know, but it's good practice. Uh, I think that's it. I think that's I think that's enough, but I think that's it. Mm -hmm. And you'll score two. We'll score two. That was top of three. Hmm. Uh, pull in two from the shredder. Pull in one from the dead angel. Cut for one. And upkeep bond. So, do I need defeat this turn? 
chosen at POW 15. What's butcher's armor and stuff? Uh, he is armor 15 and 10 boxes. And tough. Okay, so I'd be at plus two, but if he toughs, then it gets bad. Yeah. Also, when you hit him, he can potentially hit you back every time you hit him. And he can't be knocked down. Hmm. Let me just keep adding more and more rules. Hey, by the way, did I, I mention he's a Riot Quest model? Yeah, more. <laughs> no, it's it's the, the Riot Quest rules bloat. Like, Riot Quest models almost always have, like, an, a laundry list of rules. It's actually uh -huh. kind of asinine, but it's... I mean, I couldn't say no to a 10-box, 7-point model for free. And also, I love playing Butcher, so why not? Yeah. It's like feet, and I guarantee he dies in one hit, basically. Yeah. I need a six on three dice to kill at that point. Yeah. But if I feet, I get him, maybe Scrapjack, and some Doom Reavers? Although that is most of your list. Yeah. But then I don't think I have enough punching power to kill Ruin. It's like, I really don't want to feat, but if the cho if you tough or the Chosen fails to kill, I just don't even get to kill Butcher. I also think I have to mini feet with them. No, oh, that's a free strike if he goes there. Oh, that seems really good. Potentially kills all three Doom Reavers. You have a line of sight to the other dude in the back? Uh, from where I started, yes. Okay. But that burns their mini feet, which makes me quite sad. Uh, how does my feet work? Is it a pulse or an aura? While within. So I'd want that guy within range. Which I would be able to achieve. Screw it. I'm going to feed this turn. Sounds All like right. a plan. And and the hope is I kill everything. A lot of so Animag is going to go first. I'm going to, before I do anything, cast full steam on chosen number two. Okay. Because he needs that to get to Scrapjack. Just because I can, I'm also going to cast... Wait, can I do that off myself? Another friendly blighted. No, I can't. Yeah, we'll cast Bond of Gristle and Bone. Or not Bond of Gristle and Bone. Fury's Strength on the Chosen as well. Okay. Just gives them plus two damage rolls. Yep. And then I'm going to charge a Blight Archon. Or not a, a Blight Archon, a Void Archon. Mm-hmm. Just need this guy to be within 14 when I get there, so we're good. Archons are not warrior models, or they're not living models? 
Uh, I believe they are warrior models. So you would get the minus two defense. They are not. Yeah. A, they are not a living model. Okay. I will boost to hit. Okay. So Matt six misses. Misses. I hate you, Animag. Mm. We're gonna. You gonna buy and boost? I think so. You can't get much to me aside from potentially arc spells. It's just if I buy and boost, then the Mechano Shred doesn't get to boost anything. <laughs> oh, wait. I can't repair constructs with that rule, can I, anyway? I don't think so. Because that's why... Uh, I don't think so. That's why uh, chickens can't be uh, healed, right? Yeah, that's why they have auto-repair and the wolds have regen. Mechano Shredder, what is his healing rule? I think he has assimilation. Yeah, he does. Yeah, if he kills a construct. Okay, well, I'm going to buy and boost then. Okay. That'll hit. Yep. Uh, Animag is POW 15 because of feet. Okay. Dice off two. Take three. But you're also man catched, so you're not allowed to advance. Okay. Well within my melee range. So I can't advance. If you like Gallows Animag away from you, you can advance. Okay. Yeah, it's a warrior model hit, suffers minus two defense, and for one round cannot advance while within this model's melee range. Interesting, okay. Yeah, that's a weird one. Uh, Mechano Shredder, because you can't do anything else, <laughs> is going to advance up and try and bite it. Yep. Uh, Matt 5, Nidalmas. Doesn't make it. <laughs> Okay, well, that was horribly disappointing, Animeg. You might just die to that thing's spray now. Chosen are to go. They're going to run charge. This one is charging Zibutcher. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I liked it when, better when you weren't in the zone. <laughs> this one is charging the Scrapjack. Yep. I can't get base to base, so we're not even going to bother. Okay, we'll do the one into Butcher first. Okay. Defense 14. Not that you're going to um, miss. Seven. Cavalry charge will hit. Yep. Uh, pow base 13, 15 because brutal, 17 because of the spell, 19 because of Dark Shroud. Uh, armor 15. So plus four. Yep. That'll does do. 12 damage and Grievous Wounds because of feet. Yep. Uh, other guy into Scrapjack will hit. Pow 19. Uh, off three, I believe. Ooh, take all of one. To where? To all the right. four. Sure. <laughs> wow. Uh-oh. Chosen. You. This, is, this is going to be real bad. Warmongers are going to mini feet charge and run. This guy is going to... So speed five goes seven because the mini feet yep. charged up to ten inches. So I've got lots of leeway. If he goes here, he does not eat a free strike. Yep. Because I'm still in melee range, targeting the guy in the back. All right, Greg, how far is your eye? Within eight. So you can see me. He can see me, probably. Uh, I don't know if this guy can see me. I'm just gonna check something real quick. You charge just with it. Okay, never mind. Okay, I need to check if I if I was gonna soul collect off of that. Oh, with void or ruin? Ruin should have soul collected uh, as well. You should have picked up the uh, the soul off of the uh, off the chosen. It's a five inch range. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, the chosen, I don't think, died it in five. Oh no! All right, I'm cheating. 
Okay. Yeah, because the chosen was just inside the zone. Yeah. And ruin threats nine, correct? Yes. Yeah, can't really avoid that with you. So you'll just go to there. That guy will go to there, try to body block. All right, they will move like so. I will mm -hmm. do my charge attack against number two. Yep, def 13. Uh. Matt 10? Don't roll double ones. Don't do it. 16? Yeah, that'll do. Pow? Uh, Unbelievable. Pow 16, Grievous. Oh, sorry. I could throw um, yeah. yeah, you're going you're gonna to kill uh, all three. Berserk into that one. Yep. That'll hit. Yep. Hits a 16, and then Berserk into the last one. Uh, Only hits a 12. Miss. So I'm guessing that misses? That misses, yep. That's okay, I moved the other guy too close, so if I killed, I would have had to whack my own guy. That would have been pretty If cool. I kill the solo, do they lose Apparition? No, it's it's a theme benefit, actually. Oh, okay. Uh, solo, he is the... I'm just debating which one I want to kill more. With the Naga. Because Ruin's going to do what Ruin's going to do. There's no stopping that. It's true. So he has a 8-inch spray that does power 12. Uh, if you spike, you can kill a lot. Whereas the Doom Reaver... Just gets to kill, like, one guy. Although you could operate there and then do some nasty things. I think I'm more scared of the Doom Reaver. Naga's gonna go. It's gonna walk up to here. Mm -hmm. It's gonna boost a melee attack into the Doom Reaver. Hey. That'll hit. Probably. How? Uh, pow 10, so I'm going to boost damage. That was also crit, so you're shadow bound in case. Thank you, Beth, for liking the stream. Probably kills. That'll... Tough check. Oh, no. You st Is it only warrior models that get that? It's only warrior models, yeah. Oh, he's dead. Okay. Uh, I'm going to Rile for one, because there's no point not to. Mm -hmm. I believe that is all my stuff, so go. Okay. Nobody scores. God, so much of that went oh, terribly. That that chosen uh, <laughs> that chosen charge into, uh, into Scrapjack. Scrapjack. That was, what's the defensive stats on your caster? She is a 14-16. 14-16. If I take a free strike from you uh, and I run, do I stop where I'm running or do I continue the run? With what? A jack. If I run, if I take a free strike from uh, with um, Scrap Jack. It only works on warrior models. On my caster. No, I'm talking about free strikes. If I run Scrap Jack. Oh, like that. And yeah. take a free strike. If I take out your movement, you'll stop. Uh, you'll literally have to kill me for that to happen. Uh, I'm going to roll fire on him. Still going. You want to roll damage? Two. Uh, it is POW 14 because of Grievous, I believe. Grievous doesn't do that. Or not Grievous, Dark Shroud. Dark Shroud is only for the turn, I believe. Oh, yeah, it is turn. So two to the one. One. Okay. 
So, I'm going to apparate. That was that such was a bad. Difference. That was rough. That was really rough. Okay. Let's get rid of you. I'll wait a second. Let's fill back up to seven. Uh, I am. I feel not... like I should have done more damage to Scrapjack with that charge. Plus three, right? Yeah, he had one damage on him. I think oh. I, I think you said plus three, and I thought minus three. Oh, okay. Because I rolled a four, so it should have done seven instead of one. Okay, I just did that. Okay. Uh, Avatar of Slaughter is getting dropped. I thought it was our twenty for some reason. <laughs> I guess I just <laughs> that'd have been pretty cool. That. Okay, Grey Lord Escort, you need to do something fantastic. I need you further back. Right there. Okay. Okay, and your your armor what right now? On the chosen? On chosen arm 19. Arm 19. Uh, defensive stats on your caster? 14-16. 14-16? This is doable. Okay. Um, escort is... The Grey Lord Escort is going to get the press forward order. But before he does that, he's going to do a Frostbite attack into uh, the Chosen. Okay. Uh, it's an 8-inch spray. It's just not going to be yeah, on the two Chosen. Both. So on mm -hmm. number 1... Uh, what's your, your defense 12? I need a 5. 12. That'll miss. And on number 2, I need a 5. That'll hit. Are your armor 19? Armor 19. Is your 17... Okay, off 7. Nothing. He's going to have to press forward. Yeah, 17 base plus 2 for bond. Yeah. Right, 2 inch reach. Uh, I am at five. Mm -hmm. I'll miss. Why not? Yep. <laughs> Just keep these dice up. Right? No, you're getting them out of the way. Yeah. Now what's, you're going to roll 14s and stuff on my caster. What's your current pal on your, uh, on your chosen? Uh, 13. 13? Base off three. Uh, oh, how long does Fury Strength last? Turn. It's not an upkeep. Yeah, turn. So days so off. Yes, yeah, days off three. Average, I do seven or eight. So if I hit the two or three with a spike, or two with a spike, or if I hit the three, it's likely to lose the arc node. Yeah, I'm not worried about the arc node. I'm just worrying about keeping my movement. Okay, I think Void Archon goes next. Um, be careful when you leave my melee range. If you leave my melee range in the mount, I believe I'm allowed to free strike you with that, and it is crit knockdown. Yeah, I'm staying. I'm staying away from the mount. I'm going out. Oh no, it's always it's always your two, max range. If you leave and I have the option to use my half inch melee weapon, nothing says I have to use the max range. Okay, so something like that would be okay. Yes. Okay. Then you wouldn't be able to get the mountain. Oh, you're going to teleport to Scrapjack. I am. I am going to teleport <laughs> to Scrapjack. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Not sorry. Uh, I mean, it was a terrible damage roll on my part, but yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. Okay. First, uh, uh, Void Archon is going to go. Uh, what's the defense on the Mechanic Shredder? 12. 12? Okay. Uh, I need a 5 with a melee attack. That'll hit. Your armor is... 15. 15? Dies? Did. 
I'm going to teleport. You cannot teleport. It is not a living or undead model. Oh. You're right. <laughs> You're so very right. Okay. Uh... Spray me! Yeah, I'm going to just spray your caster <laughs> then. Screw it. Is, it. is it a clockwork vessel? Does it have no. a soul? Give me no, the it soul. Doesn't. Oh. It is not a clockwork vessel. It is purely a robot. Okay. Uh, your defense 14, you said, right? Yeah. Need an eight. eight. No. Fine. So I can't advance at all. You cannot advance. Okay. Take your free strike on Scrapjack. It'll hit. Yep. Off three. Take 10 to the one. That's all that's left is movement. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, Old Witch is going to activate. You don't have anything that can arcane vortex or anything. Uh, I'm going to nope. spend two for avatar on myself. And then I'm going to spend two to teleport. Mm-hmm. Uh, you are defense 12 in the back. Yep. I am currently Matt 8. So I need 4s. This is the first swing. That'll miss. Uh, second initial. That'll Hits. hit. Uh, your armor... 16. 16. Off 1. 6. 6, six. First buy. This is really going to suck. That'll hit. Hits. Off 1. Take 3. three. Next buy. It's, it's six. six. And last one. It's can't uh, not kill. Can't not kill. Oh. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> <laughs> that one turn was just brutal, Mike. Mm -hmm. I Everything went right for me and everything didn't go according to plan for you. Yeah, if the Chosen had rolled moderate damage, I'd yeah. be fine. Or if Animaga just hit her charge initial. Yeah, I think that I think uh, the uh, Voidar can be dead. Yeah. Um, and I would have had two transfers up because I wouldn't have had to spend it trying oh, to lock down the Void. Hundred percent. Yeah, that was uh, that was sketchy to say the best. Mm -hmm. But good game. That was uh, that was a little crazy. Anime, <laughs> why are you not Matt Seven? <laughs> they don't call you the community killer for nothing. Thank you, Brian. I appreciate that. You know, actually, community killer was a uh, was something that uh, was was kind of a, a joke because there was a discussion about spreading out to different stores, and I really wanted to try and help build the community and in order for tabletop gamers to have new opponents or to be able to beat up and kill, you have to build a community to do that. So the community killer is actually a tongue in cheek thing. Uh, that's the idea. Uh, I haven't, uh, Brian, I haven't seen any lists. I'm really hoping to dodge actually. I just, I just don't know what I'm doing. I think that, I think old witch is super toolboxy though. Oh, I guess I could have done that. What's that? Uh, when the Chosen killed Butcher, I could have cast the armor buff on my caster. Well, I mean, hindsight's twenty twenty on that one. I mean, then I don't think I'd do that, because then I'd lose the armor buff on them. Yeah. I also yeah. have no idea she could do that until you started doing it. Oh, then you saw, like, Unseen Path, and you're like, oh, no. He doesn't need to arc node that. <laughs> It's a pretty it's a pretty entertaining yo-yo tactic actually. Yeah. Cause you can you can actually leapfrog with them as well. If you I mean if you really need to leapfrog, you can. Mm. But she has the one of the worst defensive stats in the game. Yeah, she's 15, 14. I mean, she's a she's a 29. 15, 14. It's better than Sevy one. 
Doesn't Sevy One has have a feat that says "Don't come near me or you die"? No, that's Sevy Two. Sevy One's feat is different. His is you get minus two to focus. Okay, don't come Sevy near One's me or feet. you can't do anything. Sevy One's feat is enemy models cannot cast spells or be used to channel spells, and Warcaster Warlocks get minus two focus fury. But he is a fourteen fourteen stat line. Oh, okay, so he's. Okay, the old witch is just slightly off of of him. Yes, I mean, 28... I think fourteen fourteen is the lowest caster stat line. I think that might actually be. Can you think of another one that's that's lower than that? Nope. I mean, Karchev is a twenty nine technically, but yeah. But there's... how many boxes does he have? <laughs> Thirty four. <laughs> The thing with Sevy is he's fourteen fourteen with sixteen health. Yeah, how many? He is. What, what's his spell list? I love these little chats after games because this is kind of what makes. What, uh, a little... Sevy one has Defender's Ward, Ash of Ashes, Death Sentence, Immolation, Influence, and Vision. Oh, so he's just like straight up terrible. I mean, he has everything in my control range gets plus one to hit and damage. Oh. That's good. It's a passive effect. It's just always on. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> Ashes the Ashes is really good too. Mm -hmm. No, it's not. He also is not warded. It's not. It's not really. I'm just looking at that. Vision is good. No, I fucking love my or Ashes the Ashes. Ashes the Ashes is decent. Um, it's really good when you arc it through, uh, Blessing of Vengeance because all of the damage rolls get plus two pow, oh, so they're that becomes it's really pow ridiculous. thirteen with D three extra pow thirteens. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. Never mind. On his own, it's still POW 11s. I'll stop talking trash. I don't want somebody to roll up with him on me and be like, hey, by the way, I heard you talk shit. I'm like, oh no. His his biggest thing is he's, I think, the only model in the game that still lowers Focus and Fury stats, so it shrinks people's control ranges, and nobody expects that. Mm hmm. However, it doesn't work on uh, Infernals, so obviously. No, it garbage. doesn't work on Infernals. It also doesn't work on, like, the Egregore. It doesn't, does it? Well, if I don't think if it hit the witches, don't they have focus stat? No, their focus stat is star, and it's equal to three times the number of witches in play. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's. I mean, I, I honestly, Egregor is the most triggering. Um, caster in the game for me. He really is. I'm not even kidding. Uh, I, it was probably like a year and a half ago. It was probably like a year and a half ago. Uh, Paul, uh, one of the players that uh, regularly plays, he uh, he's like, uh, you want to have a game, Ian? I'd be like, yeah, sure. He, uh, and I literally would like dot like looked at him and face dodged him because he's like, I brought egg, I bought uh, Witch Coven. I'm like, I don't want to play you. <laughs> I don't. I that that caster is so triggering for me because I it is so stupid. Mm -hmm. Honestly, it that caster ridiculous. that caster is still meta. If somebody brought out Witch Coven, it would be so meta defining. Um, even like with strange bedfellows and all kinds of that crazy mm -hmm. shit. And they even nerfed it. Yeah. I I was told like um the first time I was introduced to it was uh, when Garnet was playing. Uh, was playing them and he's like i got like 300 games in with this with this caster so um and this is when i was like brand new like i was a baby seal i was getting i was getting just tossed around the uh um brian's house in in games and i was just like face smashing my face into the table uh trying to learn the game mm -hmm. playing that guy was playing that caster was just bleh. oh yeah I should I should yeah. actually start playing uh, Cricks a little bit more and just be like I'm gonna play Gatsby three and Witch Coven. Mm -hmm. Screw everyone's fun. You also have to just read a paragraph to learn how it works. You just no, you just you just learn from somebody else and you trust them. You don't read it. <laughs> yep. You just you just listen to somebody that knows more about the game than you and be like, okay, that's how it works. Cool. And then when somebody else corrects you, be like, okay, so that's okay, so it's this and that, but not that. Okay, cool. You just trust. If if somebody says, yeah, it's actually only six focus instead of nine, it'd still be good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> its feet is so dumb. Like minus oh, yeah. like you can only see five inches. Yep. 
if you're in the control area which is 18 inches <laughs> yeah of the ball roger i love that you're here and chatting honestly scar can be played around and you know exactly what she does she's so straightforward when you have decision paralysis because hey by the way you can only see five inches in front of you and the entire army is within threat range of you there's not much you can do mm. although i had the most entertaining way of murdering the witch coven in a game i think it was against roger what was it um i was playing uh what's his name legion ogren Thagrush. I was playing Thags 2. <laughs> and he ran the ball up and feeded. Thags moved up, sprayed one of my own models to catch the ball in, and I crit stationaried the ball. Oh no. The ball is not a Warcaster model, so it cannot shake. I then just bunkered Thags, and sitting 10 inches away from the ball, it's like either you kill Thags, or Thags will kill the ball next turn. Yeah. The only time I've killed the ball is I... Uh, went for a last ditch uh, assassination attempt and I got um, Siege 2 onto it, which was so satisfying. So mm -hmm. immensely. Anytime that Siege 2 goes in on a caster, it's so satisfying because just this depiction of this jump packing, like Space Marine esque model, not even Space Marine esque, it's just this big, brutish, cigar smoking um, uh, a hole slamming a giant maul into someone's face over and yeah. over and over uh also ro it wasn't roger that you did that uh too apparently okay it was caleb yeah also the uh one of the most triggering parts was i was playing convergence and i think uh uh against paul and again one of those um those witch coven times and he got a bane warrior in into uh into one of my um uh into one of my colossals and i never realized how hard those things could hit the oh, first God, one yeah. yeah it was the first one and it was like i have parasite up and i have this and i have that and i have all the different armor debuffs that that quakes can do i don't know exactly remember what it all was but he did 24 damage in the first swing <laughs> and i was like Ugh, i want to throw up this is just adding to this stupid little balls experience but like i need to start playing this caster we need a good Crix caster in our meta. I mean, there's Luigi. Luigi's pretty good. Yeah. We just need to get him to stop playing Scar 1. I almost... <laughs> That's all he plays. He <laughs> only plays Scar 1. At the last Blood and Gears, did you see what I did to a Scar 1? I don't think so. Bottom 1, uh, I killed her. <laughs> Oof. Yeah, he... Uh, I used one trident. Yeah, it was two tridents. Uh, I put... And, uh, and uh, Issy Feet. I put one, oh, yeah, yeah, I, I put one trident in to, to clear the gun lane uh, off a charge, and then I put the second one in and just -ta 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 right into <laughs> her. It was it was gross. I think I knocked her down too with the uh, with the um, with the smite. Yeah, that'll do it. Yeah, and that was that was round one of the finals of the sec uh, third day of the third day. And he's like, Oof. "So that's a thing." I'm like, "Yeah." However, I got I got taken to Pound Town from uh, Jordan Murphy the next round. He was mm. playing, uh, what was it? What's the Morrowind caster that gets all the souls? Constance. Constance. Yeah, he was playing Constance. Right when Flames of the Darkness was brand new. Mm -hmm. Love that list. Oh, I can't wait for Cons again. <laughs> it's gonna be nice. Seriously. I hear Attack X is going to try and run. Yeah, actually, I mean, September, we might all be immunized by that point. We could all be in the same room and hugging each other doing doing that thing. Yeah, no hugs. No hugs? No hugs. Why not? Is it because of COVID or just because you, you hate hugs? Because I don't like hugs. <laughs> hey, that's fine. I mean, a, a, a real crisp high five will do. <laughs> you just don't like touching people. I get it. You're just like, I'm not commenting. Uh, the next big one is, I mean, prob is probably going to be Attack X. Roger. Also, I should probably put that out uh, on, on this little podcast portion is uh, September 10th to 12th in Kamloops, uh, British Columbia, Canada, which is Western Canada. There is a con that is being prepared and potentially running. So uh, put it on your calendars and talk to Nathan Bosa 
on Facebook. Uh, he is the organizer. Uh, there's a Facebook page. You should check it out. Mm -hmm. It just depends on when vaccines roll out. Yeah, I think that's going to be a big portion of it. I mean, we should be immunized by... Like, you, me, and the next guy, like, between the ages of... I mean, you're, like, 18. You're just, like, freshly graduating... And then old people like me, like 36, should be getting our vaccine at the same time as you. I mean, I'm graduating <laughs> university, not high school, but yes. Um, I'm not 18. No, he is He is not 18. This is an 18 plus uh, stream. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, it's uh, it, it should be interesting to see when the vaccine and everything rolls up. Yeah. It's like, I'd like to go to a tax, but it depends on where I find a job after school. Yeah, you're gonna be making engineer money. See if I can find an engineering job. Oh, you should be fine. What kind of engineering did you? You took power engineering, right? Or electrical? Mechanical. Mechanical. I, eventually, I was gonna hit the right the the right all. I mean, th there's a lot of specializations now. Yeah, there really is. I mean, some oil company is gonna be able to pick you up and put you out on a site. Yeah, I'm fully willing to go up north. <laughs> Uh, I love how you refer to as up north. You're s such an innocent, naive child. <laughs> I mean, I know, I know you're not a child. I know. I'm super patronizing, I mean, it's, but it's north of both me and you. It's true. Usually, I just mean that. Like, I've been in the oil and gas industry for. Oh, they they call it something else. No, I just. I I've, I've been in the oil and gas industry for 15 years, and I put my time into all the different places in Alberta. So, it's not a good thing. It's it, this is not me reminiscing about my pipelining days. This is my. Oh yeah, I, this, I understand. This is, it's brutal. Oh god, <laughs> Roger, sweet Simba child. <laughs> <laughs> but you gotta take your licks to get somewhere better. I'm sure. I mean, you got the schooling. You got you got some some clout for you for yourself, Roger. Mm -hmm. I'm sure has seen some shit too. <laughs> All right, I think uh, on that musical note, um, it is time to close up the stream. Thank you very much for uh, for the game. Also, I want to shout out to uh, for Mike's channel one more time, twitch.tv slash fiddleswordsman. Were you streaming tonight? Were you streaming this game? Yeah. Perfect. If uh, anybody wants to, uh, to check out his channel as well, I recommend you go hit him for a follow. Also, follow my Twitch channel. My Twitch channel needs some love. Uh, it's My YouTube channel is doing great. Um, but my Twitch channel could definitely use a couple follows, if you guys don't mind popping in there. You don't have to if you don't want to. We don't do uh, we don't do that super push thing around here, but we do do a lot of other things. So, uh, thank you very much for the game. Uh, I hope you guys all have a great night, and I will catch you all later.